the South Pacific, 300 miles off the northern coast of Samoa. We're over a really deep spot, about 4,800 meters, almost five kilometers down. APLUW oceanographers deploy deep ocean sensors in search of new clues to climate change. We don't fully understand it. We know the Earth is warming up. Their goal is to map the seafloor and measure the volume, velocity, and temperature of a massive flow of deep water northward through the Samoan Passage. We're looking at the response of the deep ocean to climate change, or how the deep ocean and the ocean circulation is related, may be impacted by the Earth warming up. Recovery and deployment operations continue around the clock. On a rare break, APL's Matthew Alford and John Mickett bring some American blues to the South Pacific. And just before this research cruise to probe the mysteries of the deep, they're invited to sample Samoan culture. John and Matthew on their way to the village of Luffy Luffy on the north coast of Ipolu Island. Half a world away from their home base in Seattle. We were on a plane for a day and a half. I mean, it was the longest plane ride I've ever, ever taken. To travel that far and to not kind of interact and learn more about their culture just seems odd to me. The people of Luffy Luffy made the APL scientists feel more than welcome. We were guests of honor. They had a, a fantastic meal uh, prepared for us, and we had a lot of local foods. They were weaving hats, um, so they taught us how to weave with kind of these local leaves. <laughs> so the Peace Corps volunteer had recently got a grant for sewing machines. Uh, they're hand powered because they don't have available electricity in a lot of villages, or if they do, it's very expensive. We really did want to uh, not ignore the locals. We wanted to. We rely on the locals, in fact, for uh, you know for knowledge and uh, for for help. The Samoans really care for their ocean. They care about their waters, and uh, and they're interested in what we're doing. One of the things that we just shared with them is that there's this incredibly interesting and cool spot in their backyard. I kind of like it to like a natural wonder. I mean, we can't we can't see it with our own eyes. We can measure it. We know it's there and something like 70% of all that deep water is moving right through the small passage that moves north. Something like 36 times the flow of the Amazon, so it's a huge amount of water. So it's a huge amount of water. Today's being my ship north of Samoa. I, I thought that was fun to share with them. I said, do you know you have this pretty amazing spot in the ocean just, just north of you? And it's really important to the Earth's climate, as we think it is. Science at work for you. This is APL, the Applied Physics Laboratory at the University of Washington in Seattle.